Hello everyone, my name is Jeremy McCourt with eMerge Technologies and I'm here today to show you how to use the invoice consolidation bundle we recently released that is free for all NetSuite users to install. I will go ahead and leave a link to our web page in the description so if you find this bundle useful you can go ahead and get it for yourself. So diving in, the first thing we're going to want to do is make sure that the version you're using is the most updated version so go ahead and go to installed bundles make sure you have version 1.2.3 that is the most updated version and I just want to point out that we do have documentation for this bundle it will provide you step-by-step -step instructions to um, set it up and install it just like I'm doing here but in a PDF version also with some more information that you might find helpful so now that we have the most updated version of the bundle we're going to go ahead into the setup process so there's only one step and it's quite easy so go to customization list records and fields, transaction types, click on consolidated invoice. And there's only one field you're going to need to set and that is the account. So whatever um, account you normally set your uh, invoices to, you're going to want to set it in here. And it's important to understand that anytime you, if you uh, set invoices to multiple accounts, you're going to need to change that before you uh, make the consolidated invoices to these different accounts. So you're just going to need to go here and uh, set the account to the appropriate account, whatever you normally set your invoices to, and you set it here as well. So click Save. And there you go. Setup is complete. So now just go to uh, Transaction, Sales, Create Consolidated Invoice. And here is the consolidated invoice view. You'll see the invoice tracker number. That's a field that uh, is in the invoices that you can set if you want to track certain invoices in a, w through uh, numbers. You can just set them here, and you can find them in this uh, field here, or search for them up here. There's the from date and the to date. Um, the customer, you can search by customer too. But uh, my favorite part is just going down through here and just being able to click and just um, find uh, the invoices that way. Um, but, um, so now that we have our invoices sorted, we can go ahead and start consolidating. So you just want to check next to the invoices you wish to consolidate and go ahead and click Consolidate Invoices. You're going to want to give it some time to do its magic, but just there you go. And here it is, a consolidated invoice. Uh, here are your line items. You got the total, bill to, ship to. Um, all these could be edited. Just treat it like a normal invoice you normally set up for your company. The one difference, though, would be that instead of using the printer icon, you're going to want to click the print button with the lettering print. I'll go ahead and show you the template that we have. This template comes with the bundle. So obviously it has our information and stuff like that, but you're going to want to change that for your purposes, but here you go. And one more thing I want to show you is how to f look up the older bundles or older invoices that you've created. And you can do that by going to Sales, Consolidated Invoices, and here they are. This is the invoice we just created. So yeah, here it is. Um, so I want to stress again that this bundle is 100% free for all NetSuite users. So if you do find it useful, go on ahead and click the link in the description. And you could be setting up these invoices just like I just did. I hope you enjoy.